from Jet Setter to fatherhood. This is my life. Five o'clock in the morning, and we are heading down to CTV Your Morning. Not fun to get there in the morning, a uh, morning show, but the girls are still asleep. My mom's getting ready. Let's get downtown. It's a morning show, so I don't want anything too extravagant for them. So I'm going with these little outfits with these cute little Valentino shoes. Leaving with two babies out of the house is always tricky. You don't know what they're gonna need, how many times I'm gonna feed them, if they get cranky. It's way too early in the morning to be functional. Okay, so I got the bibs, change of clothes, food, wipes, diapers. I think we're good. Yes, you are. Hi. Hi. Good morning, little one. She's like, what are you doing? Why am I in this chair? What's happening? Is it cold out, David? It's freezing. Are you ready, Ma? Are you no. excited to get your hair and makeup done? <laughs> We're here actually early, about an hour early, so we can feed the girls and change them into their cute little outfits. Meet the smiley boy. Hey, smiley. Are you smiley today, this morning? Do you know the cameras are gonna be on you? Knowing us, they better get used to having the camera around. <laughs> but it's funny, even in the, oh my God, I got the a photo shoot that I did. There's two pictures of them that are like, out of this world. They look fake, they're so beautiful. Show us. The picture? Show us the picture. Oh, I just have like a picture of a picture. Come on in, guys. So we're gonna feed them, change them. Yeah. Oh, Amazing. Same with yours for the morning. I'll put on the show for you guys so you can watch. Yes. Are you excited? No, I'm nervous. Why are you nervous? Well, because it's not my thing. It'll be good, just like I said. Focus on her. You have a baby in your arms anyways. Just answer the questions they ask. We'll have a little thing. So if I like maybe hit your knee, that means stream it down. Stream down I'm your gonna answers. Talk as little as possible. Don't no, worry. don't talk little. I'm, they're gonna ask you quick. They're gonna wanna know what it was like for you. You were also in Kenya, so. Are you yeah. nervous is the question. I'm actually not nervous because <laughs> it's just like a personal interview, which is not that I have to. It's kind of talking about what, what already has happened. You guys getting hair and makeup done? What are you gonna do with your hair? Say hi, I'm ready. I'm ready for my close-up. I'm ready for my close-up. Are you ready? David? Yeah. Oh, just kidding. Yeah, just kidding. <laughs> you just hold her. Yeah. I'll take care of this, don't worry. Shoot just down. Don't let her grab She just kicked the Valentino <laughs> off. Shoe down. Let me help See? I'm good, you know? so good. We were together like, I don't even know how long ago. 15 together. years ago? Yeah. Yeah. Out of beta. <laughs> Joseph was an actor. And he would always leave during the show. Oh, yes. to do auditions? And then Rachel would be like, did Joe leave us? I'm like, no. <laughs> Hi, which one's this? This is Stella. Hi, Stella. Mm -hmm. Welcome to the world. Oh my mm -hmm. gosh, you guys, they're beautiful. Oh, look, there we are. There you are. Walking out of the hospital was like the greatest feeling and I was just so happy and proud and okay now we're going home and now they're with me. It was an amazing feeling walking out of there. 
So Joseph Tito and his mother Stella are with us in store in studio this morning, as are baby Stella. And Mia, welcome to the whole family to your morning. Good Thank morning. You. Good so morning. good to have you here after sharing your story with our viewers. All right, first of all, what is it like to be home? Amazing. <laughs> it's Absolutely been, amazing. It's, yeah. Yeah. After Kenya, I mean, we're able to deal with anything, and it's just really nice to be home. Yeah, so how have you been holding up through all of this? You've been a real support through this entire journey. Well, of course. He's my son. I have to. <laughs> and these are the grandbabies. My grandchildren, yes. That's our next step in our lives, right? Being mm -hmm. a grandma. You bet. Uh, Joseph, what is the latest in your legal case? You mentioned in the piece, the girls right now are stateless. This, they're still stateless. I just got um, an email saying that I, I'm good to sponsor them. Mm -hmm. And now they need to do their medicals and then hopefully they'll get their permanent residency soon. Yeah, we were explaining in the piece yesterday, and a lot of people may not realize the change in the law that happened in 2015, where it used to be that if um, children were born to Canadian parents or they'd had a, a second generation parent who'd been born in Canada, they would automatically have Canadian citizenship. And a lot of people don't realize that rule had changed, including yes. yourself. Well, yeah, exactly. Um, so basically, because I was born Canadian outside mm -hmm. of Canada, mm -hmm. um, that made me second generation Canadian, right. and um, we were unable to bring them home. So what happens next for the girls? What's, what's the next status for them? What's the next step? Uh, well, the next step is for them to get their permanent residency, mm -hmm. and then I have to apply for their citizenship. And um, yeah, then they become Canadian citizens. They do have health coverage provincially while they, they are waiting. They do, thank God, yes. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, thank I you. Bet. And how is everybody, health-wise and, and otherwise? Everyone's good. Everyone, they're sleeping. They're very I'm, fashionable. Can we point that out? They're very fashionable, yes, with their little Valentinos. But, I um, love it. I don't even yeah. have Valentinos. <laughs> Stella. Um, listen, uh, Joseph, we wish you all the best. Thank you so thank much you for so sharing much. our story. Is there anything else you want to share with other families who may be in a similar situation? <sighs> Just uh, be positive and hang in there, and everything will sort itself out. Yeah. How long do you? How long will you have to wait until you know about the residency? Uh, the residency, I'm hoping within the next month, um, and I'm just happy that we're waiting here in Canada and yeah. not in Kenya. Uh, and thanks to media and social media for that. Um, and yeah, then after that, it'll probably take about a year for them to become Canadian citizens. Personal question for you: How are you finding fatherhood? I'm tired. <laughs> 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 I am tired, but I love, I love it. I love it. They are lovely in a great family. Congratulations. Glad you're home here in Canada. Stella, thanks for coming in this morning. She's answering your question. Yes, Mia and how's it going, Mia? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. How's he, how are you doing? Oh, good. Yeah, super glad. <laughs> All right, thanks for being with us this morning. Thank you, Thank you so much. very much. We are at Water Baby Bond. Uh, the girls have been doing their lessons for about almost two months now. They love the water and babies naturally love the water. Um, and so yeah, you'll see how the girls swim today. I'm excited. This is Melissa. <laughs> She's actually not shooting today. I'm really sad about that. I'll be watching. You'll be watching? I'll be watching. Okay, I'm sure you guys saw her from the yeah. side. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> There she is. She's ready. Are you ready, Stella?
Yeah, she was like, 